It took just 18 hours for Pompeii to be buried under millions of tons of volcanic ash and pumice. An entire living city wiped out. Thousands of its people buried alive. The superheated air burns their lungs and melts their muscles. Their twisted and contorted bodies were quickly buried in ash. A team of scientists is now studying 15 bodies that were found together in the east of the city. The odd positions these bodies were found in intrigues team leader Lawrence Alapon. It's very interesting how they found the bodies because we find several groups together, three people together, four people together. It seems that they, they may be helping each other. And we want to know what's happened exactly with these people. To do so, they're scanning the casts in more detail than ever before, taking high-resolution photographs and then x-rays of their bones locked inside. We can see the teeth. We know the teeth we can see about the diet. We can know the sex because we can see very well the morphology of the pelvis. We can know the age because for the growing of the bone. One cast is particularly well preserved. Lawrence has already unlocked personal details of this man's life. We know that he was uh, between 25, 30 years old. This young man also had a military sword, which leads Lawrence to think he was a soldier. We want to know the last moment of this person, if he suffered or he was afraid, and all this we can see in this face. The well-preserved sections of the cast are copied and then filled into other sections that are less detailed. In this part, we can see the complete side of the cast. So we have to take the complete part for make what part is not complete or is missing. The result is an image that is moving and strikingly lifelike of the young soldier who was buried 2,000 years ago. When we see the face, we understand a lot of things immediately. The nose, the mouth, everything was a people that from the south of Italy or the north of Africa. You give the human aspect, you will feel like uh, that you are living the last moments of these people. <laughs> 